I just released a major update for the Camera 3D Toolkit Pro. Stay until the end because the features I'm about to show you will blow your mind, especially the new autofocus button you're about to discover. Download link in the description, 40% off. Let's start with the spacing section. See this? I added a new button here. This button lets you automatically center the anchor point of a layer. Let me show you. I just created a simple layer. Watch. I click the button and bam, the anchor point centers automatically in the frame. Simple and fast. Another new feature, the XYZ sliders are now centered by default. That means you can go to negative and positive values to distribute your layers with precision. An example, if I slide the X slider to the right, watch, it distributes the layers precisely on the horizontal axis. And if I wanna go back to the initial position, easy. Double click on the slider and there you go, back to zero. Same for the Y and Z axis. Now let's move to the animation section and this is where it gets serious. Before, the arrow buttons made 45 degree rotations by default, but now, the buttons take the value you enter in the field. Watch, I'm going to put negative 360 degrees. If I click the arrow, it does a complete 360 degree pan. And if I put plus 360, same thing, full rotation in the other direction. The buttons automatically adapt to your values. It's super practical for creating smooth and precise animations. And if I wanna go back to zero, double click on the slider and it resets instantly. And now the star feature of this update, autofocus. Let me show you with a concrete example. I'm going to create a quick animation with several 3D layers. There we go. See, when I increase the blur slider, it adds depth of field blur. Now, here's the game changer. In the old version, autofocus only worked when the camera was moving toward a layer. But now, imagine I want to focus on a different layer without moving the camera at all. For example, let's say I want to explain this other layer right here. See? Right now it's blurry. Before, you had to physically move the camera toward that layer to make it sharp. But now, watch this magic. I simply select the layer I want to focus on, I click autofocus, and boom! A beautiful smooth focus transition happens. The camera stays exactly where it is, but the focus shifts naturally to the selected layer, just like a real cinematographer pulling focus. You can see how the blur smoothly transitions from one layer to another. The camera doesn't move an inch, but the focus does all the work. Watch, I select this layer, click autofocus, and voila. The camera focuses naturally, as if a real camera operator had turned the focus ring by hand. The incredible thing? These aren't expressions. They're real keyframes you can export and modify however you want. The transition is smooth, natural, professional. You can now create cinematic focus pulls without ever moving your camera. Honestly, this is an absolute game changer for storytelling and visual hierarchy. The plugin is on sale right now and the price will increase very soon. Don't miss this opportunity. Another improvement, the opacity button has also been updated. You can now select a layer and dynamically adjust its opacity based on its distance from the camera. Watch, I move the slider and keyframes are created automatically for a natural fade effect. You can also select multiple layers at once and apply the effect to all of them. Super handy for creating creative depth of field effects. And as always, double click on the slider to return to the initial value. Quick bonus, see this about button? If you click on it, a new window opens with info and links to my YouTube tutorials. You can click the Watch Tutorials button and it takes you directly to my channel where you'll find tons of tutorials to master this plugin. The plugin is on sale right now. The price will increase drastically in a few days. Download it now while it's still on promo. The link is in the description. Thanks for watching and see you very soon for more tutorials.